So I live in New York City, and once in a while I'll take a stroll through Central Park. Sometimes I see bird watchers. At least I hope they're bird watchers, because otherwise binoculars are hard to explain in the big city. But I don't get it. No matter how strong your binoculars are, how can you tell a warbler from a nuthatch when you're bird watching from a football field away? Well now, spying on our feathered friends is getting much easier because almost all birds have a need for seed. Here's Allie Ward to explain. Skittish sparrows, starlings, and swifts are all notoriously bad at one thing, taking selfies. Now there's a new device that allows avian aficionados the ability to peek at our plumy pals. It's called the Bird Buddy, and it's a smart bird feeder that can capture and collect photos of its winged visitors. This is Kyle Buzzard, co-founder of Bird Buddy. I spread my wings and flew to Kalamazoo, Michigan to meet him. I'm sure you get the question about your name having Buzzard in it. <laughs> Were you always a bird lover? I grew up with my family really loving birds, and my dad instilled in me a passion for science and nature. You also had a hand in some industrial design before this? Yes, yeah, so my background's in industrial design. This was an amazing opportunity to combine my love for nature with my tech background. Can you tell me, in a nutshell, what is a bird buddy? What does it do? So Bird Buddy is a smart bird feeder. It can identify species that come visit. It can take photos and put them into a really fun app to collect all the different species. Kyle and his Slovenia-based team of co-inventors made the feeder smart by adding a high-resolution camera, Wi-Fi connection, and a battery that can be powered through solar energy or a simple USB-C cable. These electronic enhancements allow the feeder to stream live, feasting foul footage that's then sent to the cloud or a mobile app for AI processing and identification. This is something that is almost like science fiction meets natural history. <laughs> right, it, it is fun. And we also built in things like seed sense so that when your seeds get low, it will actually send you a notification that you need to refill them. Right now, my seed sense is just a bird looking in my window being like, excuse me, <laughs> can I get a refill here? Right. And how do you refill this thing? Yeah, there's a little door in the back that opens. Uh, it comes with a seed cup for you to be able to refill it really easily. So out of the corner of my eye, I saw another bird feeder. Can we yeah. go check that one out? Sure, let's go. Okay, cool. Obviously, we're in Michigan, where sometimes it gets really cold. Are these weather resistant? It is completely weatherproof, waterproof, and it will work from negative five degrees to 120 degrees. With a collaborative network of data collected and shared by thousands of Bird Buddy users around the globe, Kyle wants to help people get back to nature. Birds are really a bite-sized, really easy way to get back into nature. They're all around us, they're colorful, they're fun. I mean, they can fly and sing. Who can do that? <laughs> can you imagine if I could fly or sing? That would be crazy. <laughs> people would be taking pictures of me too. Right. <laughs> 